No, I never cheated on Trey. Okay. Yeah. And what about these messages? The messages was just that. They was just messages. Why were you just texting them back and not blocking them and telling them I'm in a relationship? I didn't think it was really a problem because I didn't flirt with them, so. Mm. Mm. You see that got a reaction. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> All right, and I, he said earlier that you're typically friends with males, which again is fine, but in the context of this, you know, so are you typically only friends with men? I have female friends too, but it's like most of them were males, so, but I cut a lot of them off, so it's like now I only have two male friends. Mm. Can you like kind of tell me what was like the main issue so, I can, so we can have a better understanding of why they couldn't be cut off? I don't think it was a problem because I did cut the, the ones I needed to cut off, I did. I only have two friends now. My two friends was never a problem in the beginning of the relationship, and I knew them before him, so I don't think I should have to cut Why didn't it work out between you and your ex? <laughs> <laughs> Feelings changed everything, so it's like we Feeling started- changed on his part or your part? My part. Okay, so he still wants you. I, he Definitely do. Definitely. Have your feelings fully changed to him, really, in all sincerity? Yes, I have. Fully? Yes. Okay. I feel like you said feelings. yes, like you tried to convince me. No. <laughs> <laughs> no, my okay. feelings have changed. Okay. I got a question for y'all. How old are both of you? 20. 25. You're 20 years old? Okay. I'm 25. You're 25. Got it. 25. All right, so how does um, Trey keep you from seeing your best friend? He would plan something on a date. I was supposed to see my best friend. So he would get us to do something together instead of me going to see my best friend. A lot of that is because... There's a lot of planning y'all do that I'm not aware of. Um, and then the second one, it'd be like one of those things where my trust wasn't fully still there. You know, it's like after you see something like that and then you want to go hang with another dude by yourself, it's like it kind of puts up in the air like, am I Do you understand that? that? About like why? why? Allow that. You ain't give me a chance to tell you. Oh, because he found it. Right, before he I got given you a to chance say to tell something. You. But what about the second guy? I was just talking to him because I was bored. I mean, so that, was, that was just conversation. Because you're bored. Yeah. So in, in your opinion, what do you think that is the root issue of your relationship? I think he gets jealous because I talk to other guys. I think he just wants me to himself and not want me talking to nobody. So you think root issue is jealousy? Yeah. And what do you think the jealousy started? Why do you think it started? Because the messages. Jealousy could play a part. I will admit to that. Jealousy could. I could see myself getting jealous. But it's one of those things, I want to make sure like she's secure. Like I said, she's a good woman. And when you see messages or you find stuff like that and you see her engaged back or you don't see nothing saying, hey, you know, my boyfriend wouldn't like this, you know, hey, stop. Why haven't you said that? You said it's because I was bored, but that's not really a valid reason. But people know I'm in a relationship, so I, sh I don't think I should have to tell them that. In a man's head, it's like, when you see multiple text messages saying, oh, you making me horny, are you doing this? It's like, what are you doing to make them horny? You know what I'm saying? So it's like one of those things That's not just a man's head. That's in a human being's yeah, head. If you I see your partner talking to somebody else. Hold up, hold up. Where are you going? I know you want to watch more Karamo, so click here to subscribe and click here to watch more so we can keep talking and growing, friends. I love you.